All right, she's an international entertainer, entrepreneur, model, and so much more. Amara Lanegra is one of the faces of Love & Hip Hop Miami, and I recently got a chance to catch up with her and see what she's been up to, so we can see what we can expect to see this season. Well, you know, like Miami um, is very colorful, it's fun, it's very energetic, but you know, it comes with a little drama. Um, I guess I guess you'll see some more of that, but it's definitely different this season for me than it was the first one. Now, you've been named one of Rolling Stone's top 10 artists that you need to know. Was that a surprise to you? Tell me about that. Oh my, most Rolling Stone, do you know how big that is? Like, hello. Yeah, I never thought that um, Rolling Stone would consider me one of the 10 top artists to be out in the lookout for. It most definitely was such an honor. Um, and I'm working so hard to make them proud and one day be the cover, Lord. Anything is possible. Yes, anything is possible. Okay, but you've been in business for a minute. This isn't new to you. So can you tell us a yeah. little bit about how um, Love & Hip Hop has kind of helped with your career in that sense? Well, I started when I was four years old. I started as a child star. Um, then I got, you know, big in the Latin market. And then I always wanted to do the crossover into the American market. Love & Hip Hop has most definitely given me an amazing platform to promote my music, my artistry, who I am as a person, and also to, you know, uh, be, you know, an activist for the Afro-Latino community. But for my music, it, it has done great. Um, and I am so grateful, you know, in the beginning of the year, I got signed to BMG. So yeah, it's very hard to be an independent artist. Um, now I have a whole team and we're working so hard. My EP, Unstoppable, is coming out January. And my, my next single, um, Understanding, will be out January 2nd, along with Love & Hip Hop Miami, which also airs January 2nd on BH1. You got a lot of exciting stuff going on, girl. I'm very happy for you. Can you tell me just a little and bit? I, really have, I haven't even told you. <laughs> I'm really curious to know, did you know that your success would just inspire people the way that it has? Um, you know what? I was only just being honest. I was only telling my story. And if my story was able to inspire and motivate other people, then it was a beautiful thing. I never did it thinking, okay, well, this is what I'm going to do to get that. It just happens to be that way. And I am grateful and I am glad that I've been able to inspire people to love their melanin, to self-love themselves, to love the texture of their hair. That's why I also have a children's book that's available on Amazon.com in Spanish and in English called Amarita's Way and will soon be all over in Barnes and Nobles all over the United States. Um, it talks about self-love, self-acceptance. It talks about mommy and me, the relationship you should have with your mother, and never giving up on your dreams. So it's not just to talk about it, but it's also to be about it. A special thanks to Premier TV for sponsoring this segment.